Hi, Hi, this is Queen of Cups, and I'm here to do your Aries quick read. This is my resonate for Aries out there. Anything you need be down in the description box below. Thank you for your likes, shares, comments, and subscribes. Now, Aries, let me tell you something. I done did everybody quick read, but yours, you know how I am when I get to the last one. Yes, you are the last one. Happy birthday. But let me tell you something about my last ones. They always got a whole bunch of shit going on. Okay? I think a whole everybody got a whole bunch of shit going on. Let me just take that back, babe. It ain't no, it ain't you. Mm-mm. I hear about it getting hit with something. I don't give a fuck if you say you ain't or you is. You is, okay? I don't mean to be so... But I'm just saying. People are like, I ain't going... Yes, she is. It ain't what you... What I'm going through, but you're going through. Okay? Um... And it ain't necessarily got to be a bad go through, but we all go through something because life ain't perfect, okay? So you're going to have them hiccups, okay? Usually, if you're very spiritual, you get a goddamn sign before it comes. Uh huh. And every time you don't even got to be spiritual, to tell you it's going to come when it comes. Okay? So I'm going to just tell you. Okay? Um, okay, Aries. But you will be receiving, receiving a lot of intuitive messages in the month of April about a situation. Um, you might be dealing with the Scorpio. I don't know why the hell they popped in my mind. But Scorpio, Taurus, Leo, and maybe a Pisces, Cancer. Okay? And I ain't need to pull them cards. That's just what it feel like you, you dealing with. Mm-hmm. 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 That's it. Hope y'all enjoy it, y'all. Birthday. All right, party, party, three of cups. We having a party, party. We having a party. We having a party, party. We having a party. Okay, Aries. So you partying, having a good time, feeling good, looking good. We we'll up in here. Okay, just don't get too drunk. Okay, you definitely holding back. Yeah, trying not to get too drunk. Trying to watch your spending, even if it is your birthday, what have you. Oh, oh, this birthday you gonna try to hold back, but like I ain't got it. And get treated. I mean, it is what it is. Okay. Um, other than you like this birthday, I'm going to turn up a little bit and I got to save the rest. I can't be fucking with y'all. Okay. Out here. I can't. Okay. Every like I'm on a different mission. Understandable. Some of you guys might want to uh, move as well. Some of you guys may not want to even party. Yeah. Somebody might be extending a, vac um, a vacation. Might be need um you might be needing a vacation, but trying to be extend some type of party invitation to you, some uh you getting out. Something got you to the point you don't want to get out. Something might have came out as well, something might have been expressed or exposed to the point that has you to the point, um, Eris, you don't want to do nothing. You like I just wanna sit in the house. Um, I don't wanna do nothing. I don't know what to do at this point after something has been exposed or what have you, or you're just not in the mood. Eris is wrong. See, didn't I tell you? What is wrong? This goddamn is it the King of Pentacles? This Virgo Taurus Capricorn. Um, told you Taurus, didn't say. Um, I feel like you know, um, this when it comes to this Virgo Taurus Capricorn, um, you. It's like you got it, but you don't got it. And you got it, but you don't want to, you know, spend it all. It's something about you and your money during the month of April, okay? Um, this is you also um, maybe rejecting this from this Virgo Taurus Capricorn. You don't want their money, maybe. You don't want to party with them. You don't want forgiveness from them. I'm getting a lot of forgiveness or what have you. You just may be stuck in the past. This person may be really, really hurt at you. And you're not over the hurt. Yeah, this got to be dealing with the relationship. Two of cups at the bottom of the deck, okay? Yeah, you moved on. This person moved on, okay? Or you moved on from, um, you will be moving on from this person trying to offer you um, some type of commitment, emotion, what have you, okay? With the Ace of Cups, you're going to be um, looking for your wish fulfillment. Or this Virgo Taurus Capricorn um, is your wish fulfillment, okay? You want new love with this person, okay? You might be dealing with the Sagittarius as well, Um I feel you got one foot in, one foot out. This might be dealing with some type of relationship, marriage, or what have you, okay, where you have one foot in, one foot out, where you don't want to be involved in this situation anymore, or you do, okay? But either way, you want some type of new love, new emotion when it comes to this Virgo Taurus Capricorn, okay? I feel when it comes to the other person, um... Maybe a, Le a Leave or a Gemini Leave or Aquarius. You don't have the same emotion. You're ready to turn your back. Some of you, yeah, this is definitely dealing with the marriage or what have you. Or this is somebody dealing with the justice system as well, okay? Um, you have a decision to make, Aries. 
pretty much <laughs> you have a decision to make okay some of you are in the third party others of you you're just um dealing with some type of i don't want to spend my money i'm saving my money um i'm looking at things different from a new emotional found sense um some of you might be even de um, be dealing with a legal situation to the point you can't, you know, spend like you want to do on this birth. Oh, I'm going to sign this art. Yep, might be dealing with the Leo. Two of Cups. Okay, sword. Make the change. There you go. Some of you guys might be cutting your hair, dyeing your hair red, um, growing your hair back. Um... If you want short, maybe you're going long. If you went long, maybe you're going short. Um, if you're going curly, you're going straight. If you used to wear dresses, you might wear a lot of pantsuits. If you wear a lot of pantsuits, you might wear a lot of dresses. Um, if you want to decorate your home, you're going to decorate your home. Things like that. You're getting a whole bunch of things that you are ready to change. Um, Aries, and I feel this is why you're rejecting whatever it is that you're rejecting from this person, whether it be emotions, an offer, or what have you, okay? It's like, nah. I'm good. I'm good. Seven. Seven might be significant to you. You might be seeing uh, uh, the number seven a lot, okay? Garden. Some of you might be tending to your garden. Need to tend to your own garden, okay? Take care of yourself, okay? Um, garden. Something lovely will grow from this, okay? And it will because you will have... Um, once you know that you rejected whatever this is um, that's harmful to you mentally, physically, emotionally, you will be fine, okay? You will be fine. Um, but I feel you have to reject it, okay? Now, 26 is at the bottom of this deck. It says feather. Think first before you judge, okay? And this is also with that, um, for some of you guys, I feel this person that's maybe coming back around, you like, hell no, I don't want it. For some of you guys, I feel... Um, don't take it. Others of you, you might want to take it. But uh, when with this one... Um, Something will grow for this. I feel this is an opportunity as well that you might have rejected. That now maybe have came back around um, to maybe work with maybe some old co-workers or something like that. You're going to turn around and accept this offer, okay? It might be in the legal system or dealing with something legally, okay? Um, okay. I like it. But you definitely have a decision to make in the month of April. All right, Aries. I hope this helped. I will talk to you later. Bye.